Hey everyone, this is Trevor Daly. Hey, I want to share a quick tip with you, and it's how to import multiple cards in a Lightroom at one time. Now, I've been doing this in Photo Mechanic for quite some time, and I just recently discovered you can do it in Lightroom as well, but it's a little known trick, and so I thought I would share it. So basically, the way it works is when you come into Lightroom, you'll have your sources over here on the side where you want to import. So when you choose import, and you say, I want to import from this card or what have you. Now, these are uh, shot with a Canon 5D Mark III, so that's how the structure is set up. But here you can see when I click on one card and I try to click on another one, it doesn't allow me to control click or, or command click. I can't click multiple of those, okay? But here's the trick. Leave devices, go down here to files, and you'll see if you just open each one of these up. Now you have on my camera structure, it's under this DCIM folder is where the images are. So if I just click this and make sure I say include subfolders, because sometimes there's multiple subfolders in the DCIM structure. Now this could each card's gonna be a little bit different, but but you'll know from your camera. Um, make that make sure that's checked. Include subfolders, and now I can command click or control click these other folders, and each one is gonna import at the exact same time. So when I hit import, now I'm importing three cards all at the same time into the same folder. What's convenient about this is that if you come home from a wedding, let's say, and you have three cards um, or four cards or what have you, and you have all your card readers plugged in. Now instead of importing one and then going to bed and doing the next one in the morning and then waiting for a half hour and then doing the next one, just do all three at one time, go to sleep, check them in the morning, make sure everything's there and, and you're good to go. So no longer you have to have those cards sitting on your desk, just uh, get them all imported and be done with it. Hopefully that was useful you guys. Um, make sure to follow me here on YouTube so you can get more tips in the future. Thanks so much.